John, when you drafted Chig out of Maryland, what stood out about his performance that made you want him to become a Titan? Well, I think it was his versatility. You know, they used him in a lot of different uh, areas offensively. He played on the end of the line of scrimmage. He played detached in the slot. He played wing. He played fullback. He was athletic. You could see his speed, his fluidity in route. He was good with the ball in his hands after the catch and was competitive as a blocker. So just a lot of different roles uh, that he played there for Maryland. And, you know, he's improved on those here. Speaking of good with the ball in his hands, what about Tier Tart? That was some kind of interception he made in Indianapolis. Yeah, um, big play for us uh, defensively. Uh, he was gripping it after the game tighter than a kid with a new toy at Christmas, I think. But, uh, you know, that front, the, the entire front, they were disruptive all day. You know, we've gotten some versatility, moving some guys around with flexible pieces here and there. And, um, you know, Tierra continues to improve, and we're going to need that down the stretch here the rest of the season. What allowed you to get the running game going at Indianapolis in spite of the fact that the Colts were number three in the league against the run? Well, I thought we did a much better job of hitting our landmarks as blockers. You know, that was something that we focused on all week was, was getting to the right angles, getting to the right spots on the blocks so that Derek could get going. Derek had got some speed built up. He was able to punch through the line pretty good. There were a couple runs in the second half that were, you know, we got caught up in the fray a little bit, but they were really, really close to punching through as well. Looking at the commander's offense, a lot of versatile pieces. What's the challenge of trying to defend them? Well, it's, they do. They've got a lot of pieces over there. You know, Gibson, the running back, he played down the road at Memphis. Uh, he played slot receiver there at Memphis, and they use him out of the backfield some there at Washington that way as well. Catches the ball well. He's got great high weight speed. They're really fast at receiver. You know, McLaurin's been a pro bowler. Samuel plays in the slot. He's a great catch and run player. Dotson's a first round pick out of Penn State. Really good route runner, really fast. Good with the ball in his hands as well. And then Wentz, he's big, he's athletic. He's got a big arm, he can extend plays. So they've got a lot of threats over there on the offensive side of football. All right, John, as we wrap up, you've won two in a row. What do you want to continue to improve upon as this team heads to Washington this weekend? Well, I think it's those details that we talked about last week that you know kind of came up in the second half some that we executed in the first half. It's staying on those landmarks in the run game. It's hitting some of those targets on, on the pass plays to give us a few chunk plays. Uh, defensively, it's continuing to stay stingy against the run. You know, we did a great job against Indianapolis stopping the run. We got to continue to affect the passer and not give up a handful of chunk plays down the field to allow drives to keep going.